Welcome to Lazada, the online destination site across Southeast Asia. This video is directed for cross-border sellers. In this video, we will be teaching you how to do content creation via single upload. First, do not list any duplicate SKUs or prohibited items and brands. Please check the related materials regarding our zero tolerance policy on Lazada University before listing SKUs. Then, log in your Malaysia Seller Center. Click Products, then Add Products to start creating your SKU. Currently, you have two creation methods. Option 1, select an existing product. Option 2, select a category. For option 1, choose an existing product in Lazada database. Input keyword and click Search. The system will automatically showcase a selection of existing products. Then, preview the SBU information. Since all existing SBU values are fixed, seller cannot edit the SBU information. So please ensure all pre-filled values of that existing SBU match your product information. Click OK to continue. For option 2, choose the most accurate category. There are three methods. First, you can select the deepest category directly. Try to avoid choosing other. Or second, search by product name and choose from the suggestions. Or third, search by previous used categories and choose from the suggestions. Starting from step two, you can toggle between normal and advanced view. Under normal view, only mandatory attributes will be shown. You are recommended to use advanced view to input more information for your products. If you have chosen option one, in step one, to start listing your SKUs with an existing product, the gray fields of SBU attributes cannot be edited. Please fill in other editable fields of product specifications and attributes. You can hover over the I icon to know more details or request to add new attribute values by clicking the link. Click Next to proceed to step 3, More Details. Both names should be in English and exactly the same. Keywords and important attributes should be included as well. Use English sentences with neat layout. You are recommended to provide high-quality product description to increase product conversion rate. For example, insert images or videos in the description. Besides, if you insert the embed URL in video URL field, the video will directly show under product images on Lazada platform. Please fill in three to six concise highlights. Cross-border sellers should choose no warranty only under warranty type and do not fill in other fields about warranty. Click Next to proceed to step four, SKU and image. Fill in product information directly for SKUs if no SKU attribute available. For SKUs with available SKU attribute, you can choose multiple values to create SKU variants. They will be grouped automatically and show in the same product page after SKUs go live. SKU attributes vary by categories. You can download MY Seller Center attributes list from Lazada University for more details. After you have created SKU variants, you can go ahead and fill in other product information for each SKU variant. Seller SKU is the product ID that enables sellers to distinguish their own products. Use 3 to 50 alphabets and or number only. Duplicate seller SKU will lead to error. Deleted seller SKU cannot be used again. For quantity, please fill in the actual stock reserved for Lazada. Price must include shipping fee, Lazada commission, payment fee, payment provider fee, etc. You can download pricing model from Lazada University for reference. You are highly recommended to fill in special price to boost sale. Start date of promotion must be filled in whenever you input a special price, while end date of promotion is optional. What's in the box must be quantity times subjects or product name format. Line up multiple objects and separate by comma. 
If you have free items, use the same format as in what's in the box for free items field. Package dimensions and weight are mandatory. Insert numbers only, rounding decimals to the nearest hundredth. Select and upload 1 to 8 images. For products with freebie, you can show it together in the main image. There is no specific requirement for the format. These freebie templates are provided for your reference. Taxes is mandatory. Cross-border sellers should choose default only. For search keywords, input keywords of your product. After completing information of the first SKU, click Copy Last SKU Information for Other SKUs. Remember to revise Seller SKU since each Seller SKU must be unique. Quantity and price are editable fields. You can make changes if necessary. Fields below are not editable. All information should be the same for each SKU except for the images of SKU variants with color as the SKU attribute. Otherwise, they won't be created successfully. After completing all information, click Next to proceed to Step 5, Finish. SKUs will go live after they pass pre-live quality check. After SKUs go live, there will be ongoing post-live monitoring. SKUs rejected by pre-live quality check or post-live monitoring will be under poor quality. You need to revise the product information according to the rejected reasons and queue for quality check again. For e-commerce learning, you can visit Lazada University. For any doubts, you can visit HKPSC FAQ page or contact HKPSC directly by submitting inquiry form if you need further assistance. Thank you for watching this video and happy selling!